Hello students. In this class, we are going to see a very good type of question. There are five questions. They belong to same type. And in number system of class 9, this is very frequently asked type. So a little analysis will make it clear, amply clear to you that the question is like, they, they will ask you either evaluate or find the positive square root of. So we need to find out positive square root. So what we will do is, we will uh, make the quantity which is under the square root, we will make it the whole square of something. So just by looking at here, you can see that there is one quantity here and another there. In between, it bears a sign of plus or minus in some of the quantities. So how to go about? We will make it either a plus b whole square and under root of that or uh, a plus b, a plus b whole square. So just if you take this quantity, uh, under root of 5 plus 2 under root 6 if you take. See, just focus yourself on this, that this is one quantity, this is another quantity and try to make it in the form of a square plus b square plus 2ab so that you can write as a plus b whole square and the square and under root will get cancelled and you will get the positive square root. So look at the 5 and 6. Forget about whether it is under the square root of or what. Just look at 5 and 6 and find out a quantity, make two parts let me tell, of the 5 such that if you write part 1 plus part 2 you get back 5 and if you multiply part 1 by part 2 you get 6. 6, not under root 6 I am telling you. So looking at this you can see uh, this is 3 plus 2. So I will change it like this under root 3 and square of that plus under root 2 and square of that and plus 2 into under root 3 into under root 2 and the square of this. See if I make square of this, this will come 3, this will come to 3 plus 2, 5 plus 2 under root 6. So this is same quantity what is written there but I have written it in a different form. Now what can I do is uh, a square plus b square plus 2ab. So this can be written in this form under root 3 plus under root 2 and square of that and under root of that. This can be further written as under root 3 plus under root 2 square of that and power 1 by 2. Square root can be written as power 1 by 2. This will get cancelled. So your answer is under root 3 plus under root 2. This is positive square root of this quantity, this quantity or else when we say evaluate this, we get this. <coughs> These three questions are exactly similar. One more I will work it out for you. Let us say this one. So this is 12 and that is 35. So 7 plus 5, 12 and 7, 5 is a 35. So this quantity can be written as like this. Under root 7 and square of that plus under root 5 and square of that and minus 2 into under root 7 into under root 5 and under square root of the whole quantity. See, if I take square, uh, uh, square of under root 7, it will be 7, this will be 5. 7 plus 5 is 12, 12 is there, minus 2, 2 and this is... Uh, when under root 7 is multiplied by under root 5, we have under root 35. So it is exactly the same quantity. We have written it in different form. And this time the form is a square plus b square minus 2ab. So what I can do is under root 7 minus under root 5 square of this and square root of that. So this will become under root 7 under root 5 square of this and 1 by 2. So this will cancel. Your answer is under root 7 minus under root 5. So this is how to go about and these two questions are little important. So this one you can see uh, you will find it difficult because there is no 2. So you try to bring 2 there. How to bring 2 there? That you will see. Now if I write 7 plus under root 48 and square root of that. So what I can do is I can write 7 plus 4 into into 12 and under root of that and under root of all that. So four, 12 for the 48 it is same. Now what I will do is 7 plus 2 under root 12 and under root of that. Now this can be written as under root of 3 under root 3 plus uh, square plus 4 under root of 4 and square and uh, plus 2 into under root 3 into under root 4 
and so forth. Under root of that. Now you see, the 7 has been written 7 plus 2 under root. Now this can be transferred into a square plus b square plus 2ab. So what you can see is, it can be written as under root 3 plus under root 4, square of that and under root of that. So this will come out to be under root 3 plus under root 4. So this is how to go about this. I am leaving it for you. Any difficulty you find, just write in the comment box or else give me a call. I will immediately send you the solution.